let's, let's put some water on first. Just thinking. And I'll put a bit of cream colour in this. In fact, let's wet the whole thing. Let's wet the whole thing. Let's stick a bit of cream colour on the whole thing. I'll do. And then into some. Oh, I've got my one. Oh, yeah, that's better. Small one. I'm used to. A bit of blue. I'm going to a dark blue. It's pro I think. Yeah, it's an ultra. I'll go into this ultramarine blue. Let's uh, bring that across there like that. And then there's some water of. Uh, well, in fact, really, it's all water. Isn't it? I'll leave some of that. That for water. I think we're all done. Try and get a bit of this to <coughs> run around a bit, I think. Um, yeah, that bit there, I don't want it. Uh, there, yeah, I'll let it run that way a minute. And then let's put it on an angle like that, perhaps. In fact, I'm going to take it away and just spin it round in all angles. I'll do it so you can see it. Spin it round in all angles. Let's try and get some of that. It's not doing a deal of right, is it? <coughs> yeah, I'll drink some coffee. Well, that does wherever it does. Mm. I've just been out on garden. Oh, I've been, uh, just been watching. They were like ants all over the path, right? And I reckon, not on purpose, but I reckon I must have trod on one by mistake. And they were one splattered, right? So, this other ant, I tell you what, they're not squeamish, because this other ant, like, just picked it up. I don't know where it went with it, just picked it up, and off it went with its mate. Just toddled off with it. Oh, if that rumens, a lot of people would have fainted, wouldn't they? But I don't know, just got like, starts thinking, I wonder if ants faint. Mm. I don't know. I'll tell you something what I would do with this. This. I'd spray that. I don't think it walks. See, I've got this. It don't walk anymore. I'd spray that so that bit drip down a bit more. Spray I don't want. If you can afford a sprayer, I'd get one. But that one's broken and I can't afford another. I'm skin. <coughs> it's like I was saying before, I think I mentioned it before on one of my other videos. Me and my stepbrother do for a snare. <coughs> we can't go out at the same time anymore because we've only got one pair of shoes. Mm. I was drinking coffee. Yeah, we've only got one pair of shoes, so we have to. Um, Take it in turns at going out and doing stuff now. That's how skin we are. Oh, let's have a look at that. So, I could move that camera back a little bit, perhaps. Let's move it back a little bit. Just wipe the bench dry. I've got an air dryer somewhere. I think it's, oh, it's down there. Is that a bit better? Yeah, it can. that's a bit better. Right, that's enough for that. Um, right. Stretch this paper tighter again, and I'll be second. This paper's a bit, a bit loose for my likings. Stretch it a bit tighter. It's not that top bit. <coughs> That's a bit better. I'll put a clip on the bottom bit and all. Have I got a clip anyway? Uh, I've got a massive one. <laughs> clip that is. Right. Um, <laughs> stick that on. There, I've pulled it. Get out of road, chuffy now. Look at that. There. If you want a video what's stressful to watch, what is this? Right. Oh, my neck. Looks like it's on an angle now. Is that flat? Get in. Right. Um, on to distant hill now, so I'll get a bit of that blue. I might stick a little bit of bond in it just to 
darken it a bit from them from everything else let's try that if I've, I've got the same blue and I've put a bit of bond over in it and that'll um, darken it and it'll gear to bit of by darkening it it'll just uh, bring it forward a bit from them cloud I mean that's really really faint I'm gonna dry that just to see how faint that dries Might be. You'll see it. Let's have some more coffee. Hmm. Five minutes in, I'm done though, yeah. Right, a bit more. Put a bit more brown in. Take this one. It was exactly the same height. Down a bit, down a bit. It's fading out, I'm using more water. As I come down and then <clears throat> into there, I've cleaned my brush completely now, softened that. Now, <clears throat> what I might do instead of drying, you can put a bit of mist in with one of these it's called Papa Towel. I don't know why I'm telling you what everyone knows what it's called, but you can dry it with that for your next layer. It saves it electric on your dryers. I'm probably going to I'm going to get a little glass with that. Just an equal one, because the electric bills is getting so high. Like I say, me and Doofus already can't afford to... <coughs> We've only got one pair of shoes. What we've been doing... We've been getting a tin of beans. This is a little money saving tip for you. You've seen that programme with that bloke? <coughs> oh, cough. That bloke who does them. I've had Covid. Ever since I've had Covid, I still can't get rid of this tickly cough. It were like over a year ago when I had it. Yeah, what's that bloke who does them money saving tips, right? And then... Um... Oh, I forgot what my money saving tip was. I forgot money saving tip. Yeah, he does the money saving tips. Oh, that right, yeah. Um, so, I've got a money saving tip for you, right? If you get a tin of beans, right, and then um, put loads of water in them, right? And if you do that, you can pretty much feed the whole family with one tin of beans if you put loads of water in. So, that's a money saving tip for you. I forgot that bloke's name. Who doesn't? He's always on telly. I don't watch much telly, you see. But he's always on telly and he's, he's got a name. I can't remember it. And yeah, he does all this money saving stuff. It's pretty good. If you, if you, It tends to be hard to save money if you've already got some. It's not very good if you ain't got none to save in the first place. So it, for like uh, me and Doofus, it's not that good. But if you've got a bit of money to save in the first place, or you've got something to invest or move around or something, it's pretty, pretty good. I'm not saying I'd have that and soften it a bit. Give that one a dry now. I started taking like really wide steps when I was walking. I'm taking massive steps <coughs> and um, saving on like me the plaggy stuff on the bottom of my shoes, right? But then I found out like the the elastic in my underpants we're wearing out quicker 
So I thought, oh, well, then I went back to taking like rec short steps. So I'll just take short steps then, see the elastic in my pants. But then I started wearing the, my shoes out again. So I tell you, saving money, <coughs> it's not easy. I've gone from pa pants to me. I've gone from my pants to my shoes, but, but I've worked out pants are cheaper than shoes, so yeah, you get through more pants. If you do little short steps, you save on your underpants, but pants are cheaper. I'm going a bit stronger because you can still see that line there, look. So, um, do the massive steps and make your shoes last longer. That's the best way to save money. So there you are, it's another money saving in. Money saver in, saving tip there for you. You get everything on here. Money saving, all sorts. That's it, that's covered that little line I'm going through there. Uh, right, I'm just thinking now. Just looking at that. What I've quite fancy is for this to sort of disappear. I never thought actually I've done this, I've been talking all the time and it's sort of put me off a bit. I really could do with some reflections in here. So I think what I'll do, let's wet this. So we've got soft reflections, not too wet. And I'm gonna stick some reflections in. So really I want quite a dry brush really. Try and match the colour in if I can. That's about something like about there, isn't it? And this one. This one's further back, so it's not going to stand up as high. <coughs> and the other ones are even further, but I don't think they'd even show up in a reflection. I think you'd probably get a bit off that one and that one. I'm just going to try and put the peak on that. Oh, that's too much water there. Put the peak on that one if I can. Wow, all that water. Bit too much water there. and dry my brush and just try and get them bits there up without disturbing what's underneath it. When we dry that quick, so I'll start being <laughs> Now, I've got to get my water just right in my paint. That's not bad, just the right amount of water in there. I think if this is too bright, I'll just dull it down with some of So that's coming in about there, into about there, and it's coming down and across to about this quite a thin bit, across to about that's about right, something like that. Right, and then just make a bit more in. There, 
It's not bad. Nah. Um. Put another one on to the side. Colour. Bring this one slightly lower than that one. This one's pretty steep. Comes across there. So this one's slightly closer. Comes across there. Now uh, this one. I think I'll take it just right out top of the picture like that. It's pretty steep at that. Move a few little highlights on that one. There we are. Now then, uh, there's some trees and stuff, you know. Um, I think I've not paid much attention to where the sun's coming in. Hmm. Anyway, um, right. I'm going to get some. Same colour what I've just put in, only I'm going to put a bit in there, tied that line there. So I've got that same colour, but I've just added a bit of brown to it, just to keep it more interesting. Then I think what I'll do then, I'll get a bit of brown on this bottom, look like I normally do, or a bit of mud at the bottom. Same on this one, this one's a bit further back, but I'll still add a bit of that. And then I'll just bring some bits down there. Makes it a bit more interesting. That's a bit of mud and stuff going up. I'll probably soften this in in a minute. In fact, I think I will. No, that's that's oh, it needs even softening in. So that's that. Um, oh, I tell you what, I'm tempted to, and I think I will get a bit of bright yellow in there. Brighten it up a little bit. That looks nice, doesn't it? Bright yellow, and then on this one, that blue there. So, so I'm gonna I'm gonna quick dry. <laughs> bit pop in a bit of yellow there that looks a bit better doesn't it that's just a yellow glaze on top of that I'll even go on top of some of that brown look that's just a yellow glaze <coughs> and I might even <coughs> I might even put a bit of Chinese white in there brighten it up a bit more as well um but nah On the original, there's some little trees in here, but I put them muddy banks in. They look quite good, so I can't say it whirls me lobster, so I'm going to do what I want. Um, I'm not going to put them in. I think it looks better without them. So that's that. Um, right, I'm going to now come in here, and put some reflections in of that one. So still got some of that green left, what I painted this way. So I wipe that in. If you need a little bit of white in there it looks like a bit of water line that always looks good that looks quite good at that should I get a little bit of this I might just pop that in there like that and that'll do its own thing and then just pull a bit a few bits in I'm gonna leave that I quite oh, I think that looks nice so that's that <coughs> This side's a little bit darker. I've run out of that green colour now, so let's mix a bit more. Just sort of goes something like that, don't it? Clips in way. Don't worry about them clips because that would be it by uh, mount, if you mounted it or framed it or whatever. Um, right, I'm going to pop in where this is here. I'm going to pop in a bit of a 
little dark bit there and then there's a few dark bits coming up um, I think I might even try and get not too much water on my brush now it's fairly dry I'll try and put a few bits of that yellow in though I'm happy with that, I quite like that. So that's that. <coughs> um, right, we're nearly there now. Which is good because we're on 20 minutes. I love this area here, what's just total mist now. Can't see where the horizon line ends here. I like that. That's on me. This would from a photograph. I ain't got the photo anymore, probably something like I had on my phone. And my memory runs out, I end up deleting them. Uh, but it's from a photograph. And uh, I had, I'm now working from the painting I did from the photograph, so I'm copying an old painting now. And that's quite a good thing to do because some you, when you let's try dry that a minute. <laughs> When you work from a photograph, <coughs> you tend to want to complicate everything and put in every detail. Once you've done the painting already, you've already simplified it. So then just copying the painting, it's easier. See this big bit of white here? That's just a bit of cloud reflecting in water. If you were wondering what the egg is about. Something like that. Oh, we're quite dark now with this. And then I'll be putting I'm at, I'm putting in a bit of Payne's grey now. That's quite Payne's grey, a lot of people say, oh don't use it. But I don't know, all these mucky colours, what well, I use a lot of like really dirty colours. I hardly use anything as like a fresh colour. Um <coughs> your brighter colours, they look a bit cartoony. So some of these mucky colours, let's say painting with mud, a lot of the muddy colours what I use, I get a bit of a real, more realistic effect. So, but I mean, don't just listen to me. There's, I, if I were learning to paint, I probably, prob probably, or won't right watch this dribble. I'd go and um, watch something sensible and learn. There's no way I'd watch this drivel if I were trying to learn how to paint. I'd go on a, a better channel. This is just me talking about ants and crap and me and doofus, what we've been up to and stuff. I'm sure there's some better stuff than this dribble. Um, <coughs> but it's up to you. If you want to keep watching this dribble, it's up to you. Um, right. So I've mixed in some blues, browns, the blues sometimes give you a more distant feel but I just mixed them in for a bit of interest. You know what, I might even stick some, some of them green colours in, get some low lights on these bits here though, put my pebbles and my rocks in, put a few low lights in. That's few highlights with me I'm doing my highlights with this you, uh, bank cards I mean uh, my bank card don't you this is the only time my bank card comes out of my wallet because there's no money in me bringing bank so it's the only time you'll see that uh, <coughs> right so that's that um oh yeah I said I might put I might put a bit of green in then I don't why not get a bit more interest so I'll just run out of green, I'm going to mix a bit more of it. Mix a bit more green up. So I'll go quite a dark green. Just mixing in. I need to start mixing a few colours of what I know I'm going to use before, because I may paint dry. And then it sometimes takes me a while to mix them. I'll just stick them. Just add a bit of few. That's all right, isn't it? I've just added some green in. See how that's tied it in a bit more. Like that. I'll squeeze that brush out. Uh, I'm gonna dry 
Oh, I don't know. because um, we're on 25 minutes. I don't want to take up too much of your time. Mm. I'm still supping coffee. <clears throat> right. I'm going to get this stiff brush just because. Um, I'm going to try and get a bit of this. A bit of white colour going in the stiff brush. And the paint's a bit dry on the white colour, so I want this stiff brush going. A bit of Chinese white. Just gonna bring in a couple of oh god that's strong. A couple of bits like that. <coughs> Just to lighten that up, but that's stronger than I thought. What I'll do, I'll soften that in. In fact, I'll soften that in with me to the brush. I know the brush is good for softening and come back. I like to do most of my stuff. See how it's fading though, this you don't have to panic too much because this white colour fades back a lot. I'll plop a bit of yellow in on top of that. I didn't, I didn't need to do that, I just thought. Like a bit of sun's it in it, don't it? Looks like sun's eating it a little bit. I wonder if I want to get a bit in. A bit in there now, I don't know. Like sun's eating it a little bit. See, this will fade back a lot. That fade back a lot when it's dried. Uh, right, so that's that. Um, <sighs> right, this next bit's a bit gone 27 minutes. I, don't, I really don't like to take too much of your time up. Um, see if I can do this quick. I've not pencil sketched it. No, I'm going straight in. Uh, oh, sorry, that's disgusting. I'm just going to try this. A bit there, like that. Something like that. I'd say a bit of flat end bit on there. That's the inside of a bout. It's a bout. It's a bit more up. I took that same brown colour and I mixed it with some Chinese white just to get a lighter version on it. I might up on land and then one into well I might even leave some little lines in it like that for the bits of wood running through it and then into it water and then there'd be some reflections in that water and all something like that um, and probably let's have some posts where it can be tied up to so if I have a post there and then another one like there like that and just more in posts I think they call it mooring. Mooring up, innit? But, I don't know. Who cares, man? So if I do that there, yeah, a little squiggle around there, look. A little squiggle around there, and then up to there. It's moored up. And that's a little bout. That's that. Alright, where's that tiny little brush? There she is. Put in there aren't looking for worms as per usual. Oh God. By uh and Paul. There are flying about looking for some worms. Let's get 
my autograph on here. Look at this here. Just here in this light bit here. Look. Bye. Day. At the bear. The day. At the bear. day here. And then. Uh, then I might just pop in. Give this boat a bit of definition. Pop in a few little. I've got some highlights in there. Look. So let's pop in. A few little low lights in with it. Just giving it a few little low lights and, and stuff. I can go to the back of there, is that still looking? That's not like that. Um, I could do it really. Sometimes these seats have a little bench in them. So let's try and get a little, a little bench in there. bench where they sit. Uh, wash that brush. Put a couple of little... See I'm running out of time um, but you can spend a bit more time on your boat. A little bit of some extra highlights in there just so hopefully you can see that that is a actual boat. I'm a bit worried that it just looks like a most of my things is just a blob of paint but um, could do it looking like a, a boat does that look like a boat? I think it does doesn't it? so I could do to help it um, maybe stick this little tiny brush and all I'll tell you what I'm going to do just to help it that paint's dried, an extra layer in there. Well, I'll, I'm going to come in here like this. Look, go in there up to that seat there. And I'm going to darken that bit in the bottom there, and then as I come up to the top, let it go lighter like that. Look, see what I mean? So, like this bit here, and as it gets up to the top, it's a bit lighter. In again, a bit more just in here. Look, let's start inside of that boat. Look more rounder. Uh, yeah, also, I could probably just to help with it get this bottom bit slightly darker, and the top bit's going to help as well. And then there's some. Tiny bit more. See your reflection is going to be quite dark. You don't really need to see which is boat and which is reflection. That can just be left. That's it. I've gone darker at the bottom there, look. And then lighter as I go up. I think that looks like a little boat. Right. So that'll do me at that. Now then. Um, I'm going to use this brush today for my water lines. So, mainly in here. Definitely need a bit of water line in there. Pop a little bit in there. And then, probably, a bit about there, and through there. Bit so that's our one there. What do I say? This is a brilliant effect. What do we do with brilliant effects? Or what do we don't do with brilliant effects? We don't go menstruals. Don't go menstruals just because it's a brilliant effect. Now one more. Oh, that one's faded. This you might have to let it dry and then come back in because it fades, so you can hardly see it. It's, oh, it's uh, gouts, this is what I'm using. I'm going to bring a little bit in from that side there and all like that. See, that one's fading already. Look. Might have to go over it a few times. I ain't got time, because, right, I'm wasting your time. 
oh, 35 minutes that's a long one that's one of the longest ones but that's quite nice isn't it i'm sat back now looking at it i'm quite happy with that so there you go i'll see you on beach is that let me just raise that up a bit so you can see there you are it's better in it there, nice look at that there you go with that it's it you can have talk gibberish and took me time mate. you could probably paint it a lot quicker than that if you wanted to or you can take your time anyway because um i just don't want to waste your time as ever's watching it wah wah sit there on beach in it wah wah